Hey there, um, this is a video review of the DC Universe Wave 10 Walmart exclusive black costume Batman. Kinda forgot there for a second. Anyways, here he is. Very nice figure. Um, he is the same exact Batman mold that we've got from every single Batman released in the DC Universe line so far, except for the public enemies, um, Batman. But I don't know if that really counts as DC Universe, so, whatever. Um, he's repainted in the black and yellow, um, color scheme that he wore in, well, very similar to the costume in, uh, the 1989 Batman movie from Tim Burton, starring Michael Keaton, and Jack Nicholson. Yeah. So, uh, here he is. Very, very nice paint on it. Um, first I want to point out that there's a nice matte black on most of his body, but then his, his, like, gloves, gauntlet things, and his boots are, like, glossy. Um, so there's definitely a contrast between them. It looks really nice in person. You probably can't really tell on camera, but, um, you know, there it is. Um, so, like I said, like I think I said, this is the same Batman that we've got over and over again. So he has the same articulation, um, his head goes up and down, kind of, not that much. Uh, turn side to side, he's got the ball joint in the shoulders, um, swivels at the bicep, uh, moves at the elbow, the wrist, waist, um, abdominal area, a little bit, not that much. Um, his legs go in and out, forward and back, uh, turn at the thigh, uh, move at the knee, and the foot. Now, this joint on mine is a little bit loose, uh, which sucks, because it kind of makes him hard to stand, and this spike here, um, this last one, I don't know how well you can tell, but it's bent, um, way more than is showing up on camera. Uh, so, probably have to do, like, the hot water, cold water thing or something to correct that. Um, for his accessories, he comes with the blue, clear blue DC Universe base. Um, no build-a-figure part, um, so you don't have to buy him to complete the build-a-figure. He comes with, oops, dropped it, a nice battering, um, and a bat computer sort of thing that opens up like this, shaped like a bat, very nice, um, it's kind of stupid, but I love it, I just think it's really cool, um, really nicely detailed, and sculpted, and painted, um, there's a lot of little buttons in there, there's two full keyboards here and here, I don't know why, um, that button right there, that green one, that actually has the bat logo on there. I know you probably can't tell, but it's there. Um, this battering is also very nice. It's like sculpted in hard plastic. Like, for example, I've got um, another battering over here. This did not come with him. It came with a different Batman. But it's from. It's very thin, and it's very bendy. Um, where this one is a more thicker mold, and it's like an actual hard plastic. Like, this one you can bend, this one, if you tried to bend it, it would just snap in half. But it won't break easily, because it is a very thick plastic. Um, I also like the fact that it's blue, because if they just threw in a black one, it would kind of blend in with his costume, and you wouldn't be able to see it very well. Um, speaking of the blue, it's a very nice, uh, shiny, sparkly blue. Um, 
just nice. It's not like a flat blue. It's kind of metallic. Really cool. Um, that's about it. Uh, would I say buy this figure? I would, unless you're tired of buying the same Batman figure over and over again. Um, like I said, it is just or an another repaint. I really like it. Um, I think it's a very nice bat uh, paint scheme. It really reminds me of the uh, 1989 movie. But, um, yeah, I think it, it might even be my favorite Batman figure. I know that's kind of a bold statement, but I, I really like it. Um, so yeah, pick it up. You can only get it at Walmart, because Wave 10 is a Walmart exclusive wave, which kind of sucks for some people who can't find it. I got mine at retail. Um, I didn't have any trouble finding it. Um, but I know some people are having that problem, so, yeah. Um, I would say it's worth the retail price, but I, mm, I don't know if I'd pay much more than that, um, if you can't find it at retail, because, again, it's just a repaint. Very nice repaint, but a repaint nonetheless.